In this video, you see one of Amsterdam's most beautiful hidden places of the city, Prince Island. At a 20 minutes walk from Central Station are the three Western Islands. The islands were created between 1611 and 1615 and were at first called the Front, Middle and Back Island, but eventually renamed into Bickers Island, Prince Island and Ralen Island. In this video we're gonna take a look at Prince Island. Prince Island, which was at first called Middle Island, is probably named after the first three Princes of Orange. The family of Orange is to this day still the royal family of the Kingdom of the Netherlands. Since half of the 17th century, Prince Island was intended for the storage of wood. And for approximately 20 years, also for the processing and storage of tar. Since 1644, the tar business was handled across the island. The island is connected by three bridges. In my opinion, the Sloterdijk bridge is the best way to enter the island upon your first arrival. On the north side of the island is the Three Herrings bridge, which connects Prince Island to Ralen Island. This is the number 3 bridge in the top 10 bridges. 3 Herrings Bridge The third bridge is the Gallows Bridge, which is connecting the Prince Island to the Bickers Island. The name of this bridge and the street connected to it, Gallow Street, sound a bit sinister. In the olden times, you would be able to see the gallows at the other side of the water, in which is now Amsterdam North. Until after World War II, hardly anyone lived on Prince Island. It was mainly used for storage. From the 900 storage houses in Amsterdam, more than a hundred were located over here. After the war, the island was rediscovered by artists. Since then it still attracts many people with an artistic background. Now, it is one of Amsterdam's most prestigious neighborhoods to live in.
Most of these buildings are divided in multiple apartments or split. Due to the fact that these were storage houses and obviously quite huge. And dozens of them became national monuments. A national monument is a building that is of national importance due to its cultural historical value. The government protects these monuments in the aim of preserving their monumental value. Living in a monument mostly means that you're not allowed to make big changes to for example the structure out and inside the building, like breaking walls, getting double layered glass or new window frames. This is a public tropical garden, which is quite rare to see in Amsterdam. Nelson Mandela's Vegetable Garden. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.